Welcome to Thriving Tribesmen, my name is Curry, your host, and I'm excited to be making this episode because I'm on holiday, but I still have time to make episodes and I think it's really good for me to make these episodes because I, I would have these different thoughts and I'll be wanting to share them with you guys, so hopefully they're helpful for you guys. I've had a few since Friday, I had a uh, client conversation, that was probably the last one before, I was actually already on holiday, I was traveling and then before I got to the hotel managed to have a client call and it was a really good call and we're talking about abundance and that usually most people they, because they've been rejected for so, so many times for such a long period of time they begin to have this scarcity mindset mm -hmm. and because you've got the scarcity mindset it influences all your behavior into this approval seeking behavior which comes across as needy so <laughs> when you uh, try to change a sexless relationship and then you are uh, you've got this scarcity mindset all it does is push your partner further away from the goal that you want to go so it becomes very important to start almost moving as though you've got abundance because uh, the example uh, we're talking about and it was more of a conversation rather than me coaching um we're talking about how would a guy who I mean, if you think of the most uh, famous guys, let's just say Justin Bieber, for example, who's got streams of women that want to be with him. How does he behave around sex and what is his behavior surrounding sex? He's probably not too fast about it because he's got so many options. So when you are, when you've got this abundance mindset, it eases pressure of the, your partner in order to for you to seduce because there's not that feeling of i need to you know there's, there's no feeling that i need to get this right now and if i don't get it uh, my whole world is going to implode so there's a few things that uh it helps to do when you think from an abundant mindset is the fact that she has got no pressure in order for her to feel sed sed seduction and she doesn't feel pressure to have sex so it doesn't feel like everything that you're doing is transactional so it gives her that opportunity to start participating within the seduction participating in the excitement of having sex as well so there's a um, few things that we can learn from this and i think that that's probably one of the key things when you can have less um a lot less sort of um <laughs> i've stumbled on my words here uh, when you can have less of that where you are putting high pressure seduction that's what i was looking for the word i was looking for. so high pressure seduction when you can remove that because you're coming off from a scarcity mindset it actually gives her that opportunity to her invest within the seduction and when she invests into it she gets even more value from it so she starts seeing it as valuable she starts seeing it as exciting she starts seeing it as fun and then when when it's collaborative in terms of selection it actually makes the whole interaction exciting so she wants to go back again so these are my thoughts at the moment and i just wanted to share those with you guys and hopefully you guys are gonna have a good week i'm gonna try and post at least five of them it might be challenging but i might do them in the mornings just before breakfast my daughter's still sleeping and for, for me as well, for my holiday, it's been really great. Um, we, we just, we we're expecting it to rain the whole time. So we've managed to hit the, be the beach for a few times and it's still quite sunny. So hopefully it's been tasted for the whole um, weekend. I'll be back on the 14th of August. So if you guys are looking to get a custom seduction blueprint, you can start booking from Monday. And then that would be really cool for you guys. I've got a few spots, I think, from, from that week. So I think I've got four or five spots available for you guys to go and book for that free seduction blueprint. So that's free, by the way. So it's just a free call where we find out what, what's going on in a relationship, uh, what you're trying to fix it. And then also uh, we, we then give you a blueprint so you could tasks to go and do so you can actually change your sexless relationship so thank you very much guys for your time i'll be seeing you soon take care